for you on Thursday night on Setanta Sports 1. It's Oxford against Torquay from 7.30. Hearts started Saturday's match with Falkirk, having won five of their last six games. And while two of those had been cup ties, another victory would see them move further up the table after what had been a slow start. Goalkeeper Steve Banks back in the side after illness last weekend and places two for Kanchelskis, Zaliukas and Belichka. Falkirk brought back one-time Barcelona youth Arno Riera with John Hughes warning his players that massive improvement was required if they were to avoid a relegation dogfight. Commentary from Jock Brown. Well, testing the pace here of Holden. That's good play. Good right across there by Xenavisius to Kingston. This is Jonsson. That's a good return pass. It's fine play again from Hart. Here's the chance, surely! The opening goal for Hearts! Superb play again, the ball worked across brilliantly there, with Jonsson releasing Larry Kingston on the right. You see him with a head up there, looking for the run made by Sanavikius. Picked him up brilliantly, and this time Tim Cool was left helpless. Be Michael Stewart, it's Stewart is back to play it in. Higdon back defending. Oh, there's the chance! Too easy for Zeljuka. Well, that was terrible defending by Higdon inside the area. The ball flanked in by Michael Stewart, they headed over Higdon right into the engine. Zeljukas instantly with a first time volley, and Cruel was left without a chance. Now Latapi. Well tackled by Jonsson, now the counter-attack is on. It's Kinchelskis who comes surging forward. Belichka stayed on side, played on by Milne. Now he has Kizanovikius in the middle, it's Belichka. 3-0 to Hearts. Well, it was very intelligent play by Belichka to stay just on side. Kenny Milne was the defender who played them on. And when he was... Able to come in and goal here, he had Kazanavikias in the middle of the decoy, but did the job himself with a deadly finish. Kingston to Nadi. Always turned too easily there. Nadi again. Brilliant play from Hearts. Falkirk all at sea in defence. A very good play, Nardi allowed the turn, play that little one-two with Larry Kingston, and then the shot, wide of Tim Krul into the corner. Hopeful by Scobie, one by Berra. That's a good ball by Craig, now Thompson comes forward. Well, that's well played, offside surely, it's Barrett who finishes. He wasn't offside, the goal stands. Oh, it was good play from Falkirk. It clearly was a player in an offside position as the ball came through there. But Graham Barrett was a judge to be onside by the far side assistant. And he finished very well indeed beyond Steve Banks. Now it's with Milne. Headed on, finds Holden. He's a chance for Moutinho, it's goal number two for Falkirk. Well, what a turn up at the end of the game. Hearts have gone to sleep defensively. The ball played across there, the head flick on. Left holding onside, in position to play it across goal. And it's Pedro Moutinho, who thumps it home. Now Thompson comes forward, this is a chance here for Holden again to pick out a pass, he's found Finnegan. Back to Holden. Well, they've moved up a gear all right, Falkirk, in these late stages. What a finish this is. Here's Graham Barrett going for goal, it's a good attempt. Beaten wide there by Banks. Well, Falkirk have suddenly simply come to life. They really are now an attacking threat suddenly. Why couldn't they play like this earlier in the match? 
I'm delighted with it, Jock. Yeah, Falkirk are a good football side. I think we showed today in terms of keeping the ball in possession, the way they pass it and move. They're, they're a difficult team to play against, so to get four goals at home, the way we scored them was very pleasing, but a wee bit disappointed we lost the two at the end, but I'll, I'll settle for the three points. Um, you can't win games where the goals were conceding. Uh, and I'll say this, you know, that's no at my defence. You know, it's a whole team. Um, I think uh, one of the goals we lost, Latapi lost it. I've got midfielders bombing forward, my right backs bombing forward, uh, and although you know they're encouraged to do that, you know you just have to be a little bit more streetwise, uh, and that's how we lose goals. I think Hearts hit us really quick on the counter attack. Is it time for change? Um, possibly, possibly. I'm man enough to say that. Um, we maybe have to change our formation, go five at the back and tighten it up and try and nick goals. Uh, we're, you know, the only reason we're still playing this, trying to play this style of football is because we still think it's early on in the season. Colin Henry and Stephen Craigan here on the full SPL.